Welcome back. In my last video, we looked at two parlor style guitars. We looked at the Orangewood Florence and we compared that to a Husson Dalton that I've had for quite a while. In today's video, we're going to look at two different body styles. And if you're in the market for a somewhat higher end instrument, I think you need to pay particular attention to the body style and the characteristics that best suit your style of playing and the style of music that you'll be using it for. Uh, so today we're going to be comparing an OM style body. Both of the guitars, by the way, I've had for about 30 years. And to me, they represent, at least in my experience, the cream of the crop for both body styles that I've ever played in 30 years. I've never wanted to replace either of these guitars with a similar body style. So the first is this Collings OM3 that was built in 1990. And it, it's Brazilian rosewood guitar. Of course, a solid top. I don't know if that's Sitka or Adirondack Spruce. Probably Sitka. And we're comparing that to a Dreadnought style body, which is this Martin D41. It too has Brazilian back and sides. The Martin here was a limited edition. This was built in the for the 20th anniversary of the creation of the D41. So 31 of these were made, and this is number 21 of the 31 that were built. So it is a rather unique instrument and uh, certainly my favorite dreadnought that I've ever played. So I'm going to be playing a, a lot of different styles today in the hope that one of those fits your style of music. Pay particular attention to the articulation, uh, how well you hear the melody and the uh, notes in between. So if you're not just a strummer, uh, that is going to make a big difference in the sound that you get. And I would encourage you once again to listen at least on good earbuds, Better yet, good headphones, and better yet, good stereo monitors. I hope this helps in uh, selecting your guitar.
As most of you know, a lot of the content on my channel is instructional videos about playing Jethro Tull pieces from the past. So let's see how the guitars compare on um, some of that material. <laughs> Alright, so there you go. That's a head-to-head -head comparison of the two body styles. I'd be interested to hear what you think about the two guitars and the tones that are produced and how they might fit into your style of music. So please put those in the comments below. So we'll see you next time. So strum and pick on. <laughs>